What's going on, Paisano? V here. You know, whenever someone says the phrase V hates the Yugo community, I never correct them. Uh, because they're not entirely wrong. They're not entirely right, though. I met a lot of great people and still meet a lot of amazing people in this community. Like, absolutely awesome people, whether it's car shop owners, car shop workers, and everyday average Joe sitting down playing Yu-Gi-Oh! Because they love the hobby. Whoever it is, I actually enjoy every single second. And I still do. I, I love traveling and meeting people. All of you out there. Uh, with that said, whenever someone says V does like the community, once again, I don't, I don't you know, uh, fix what they're saying. Because they're not entirely wrong. This community has a lot of pieces of trash in it. A lot of people that are annoying. A lot of dumbasses. And that ranges all over the place. I mean, all over the place. So I never correct them. And then you people sit there and wonder, gee, does V really hate all of us? No. But there are people out there. And I guarantee you play this game long enough, you're going to meet them that you just don't want to deal with. You just don't like. Uh, for a multitude of reasons. Now, whenever I start my channel, I always go... What's going on, Paisano? It's V here. And for the most part, everyone understands the word Paisano. It's not that hard of a word, but evidently it is. Uh, for anyone that's a little, little background of it, I'm Puerto Rican Italian, Spanish and Italian. Uh, and the word Paisano is both Spanish and Italian. In fact, if you spell Paisano like this, it actually means from Paisan, where the leading tower of Pisa is. If you do it like this, well, the word, the way I do it, it means a bunch of things. Um, by the way, it means a peasant of Spanish or Italian ethnic origin. Uh, I always joke around by calling you guys peasants, and we, it's all a joke. Uh, obviously, unless you really are a peasant, and if you are, then fuck, dude. Like, I, I, <laughs> you'll be the first peasant in about, I don't know, hundreds of years, I guess, but it's still really funny to say. Uh, the word by paisano means a person who shares one's place of origin. A compatriot. Especially among Italian people or people of Italian descent. Now, I like the idea of compatriot or like brethren. And the word paisano means that. It's not that hard. Once again, we just Googled it. It took two seconds to Google it. As you saw right here. Of course, some don't get it. This guy says, funny you said peasant. Did you know paisan is equivalent to a peasant? So when you call everyone a paisano, you're pretty much calling us peasants. Fun fact. <sighs> Now, I know not everybody watches my videos every single day. We know you should. It's good for you. It's like it's like eating your cereal, brushing your teeth, but whatever. Not everyone watching my videos every single day. So I have to have great patience in constantly answering what this is. Like the idea of this. Obviously, people don't know what the word paisano means, even though it's a pretty common word. No, no big deal, I say. Screw it. But to say that paisan, paisano means peasant. No, first of all, you're spelling it wrong. That act just just and no one's going to correct you, by the way, but it's really funny. You're spelling it wrong. Unless you mean people from uh, Paisan, Italy. Then sure, I guess. But people from Paisan, Italy are obviously aren't peasants. Uh, and then when, then you say Paisan over here. Once again, spelling it wrong. If you go to my channel name, it's that's how, you, that's how I spell it. It's P-A-I-S-A-N-O. But anyway, it doesn't matter. What matters is this person actually had zero idea about it. And then it said fun fact. Fun fact. You're wrong. <laughs> um, so we obviously, you know, obviously uh, someone actually corrected him. Someone uses it to refer to someone who's a compatriot, a fellow citizen, or na national of a country. It also means friend slash pal. It's, once again, the fact that I'm explaining this is annoying and hilarious at the same time. Originally, the word also was mainly used in the TV show Super Mario Brothers Super Show. In fact, when did that come out? Super Mario Brothers Super Show. There we go. Came out in 1989. I'm... I was born in 84, so I was about six when this show came out. It's a great show, by the way. Um, in the beginning of the show, which I can't play because YouTube would demonetize me, Mario comes on and says, What's going on, Paisanos? Once again, I guess Mario's calling everyone peasants, too. <laughs> so once again, I'm like, what the hell? So I try to play it off and joke around. I said, she doesn't know. Let him think he means peasant. It's more funny that way, especially if he's a peasant. Once again, joking around. And then someone said, so it's like taking a bad word and using it in good terms, like how they deal with the N-word. That's not even fucking close to it. What? I, what? <laughs> uh... <sighs> Why? How? Are we not in the fucking future where people can Google things and learn? It's not that hard. I just did it. I literally just did it. What? Where do you get the word paisano and, uh, and just put it next to the N-word? Why 
is that even being brought into the conversation? That has nothing to do with anything. What the fuck? So the guy responds again. V, please don't talk shit. I met you in Columbus right before COVID, and I was told that Paisano meant that. Then Googled it. Evidently not that much. Uh, and it's right there. Don't be disrespectful, especially if you plan on traveling to events. So there's the first threat. Um, I told him, hey, I said, listen, I plan traveling to many events, and I'm not worried at all. You should be worried about using Google and understanding what words actually mean. I have went over this several times on this channel, and you bring it up a dead horse of a subject. I said you might not have seen all my videos, but you Google and ran to the first thing you saw rather than reading into it more. Then you present the word you hardly research, and we are making fun of your lack of Google. Also, you said both Paisano and Paisano, once again about the A, which both have different dialects and locations, and you still haven't caught it yet. Then this comes up. Clearly, I don't watch your channel enough, and if I see you, I'll address it, and see you got the same energy. Internet threats? Really? Are you really doing internet threats? This is what I'm talking about. Like, you're wrong. You, you, you obviously didn't... Re uh, if you wanted to say fun fact after trying to research something and obviously not doing enough research and being corrected, you default to threatening people. Like, are you shitting me? Once again, I'm not trying to crap on the entire Yu-Gi-Oh! community. I'm just saying there are bad elements of this community that are just absolutely ridiculous. That's just annoying to the umpteenth level because it's so redundant. If this person had done a little bit more research, he would have realized, hey, this meant something else, no big deal. Or, or DM me. You could DM me on, let's see, Facebook. You could DM me on Twitter. You could DM me. Hell, you could DM me even on uh, Twitch, which I didn't know you could do, but evidently they had that feature. You could just contact me directly and say, hey, is this what it means? And I could have easily said, no, it means this. Boom, done, two seconds. But obviously, you decided, since you didn't do enough research, to start bitching and then turn around to threats. Once again, ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. The funniest part about this whole fucking situation is that I'm going to be doing this exact video for another person probably another couple of months. Because the word paisano from a guy who's Spanish and Italian evidently is so fucking foreign that people don't know how to Google correctly the word. Should I just start saying, hey, what's going on, peasants? V here. In fact, maybe I should start doing that. Fuck it. Don't worry about any of this. Don't worry about any of this. My channel name's still gonna be YJL Paisano. For now on, everyone's peasants. Until you can show me you're rich enough to know how to use the, I, the to Google. <laughs> if, and unless you can prove that you're rich enough to be using the word Google, well, the website Google, I'm calling everyone peasants for now on. Done it, said it, set in stone. Also, yeah, if there's a new event in Columbus, I'm still going to it. I don't, like, threats are just ridiculous. Like, are you insane? You can't talk things out like a regular person. You merely have to start threatening people over a fucking card game video. That has nothing to do realistically with the card game, the subject of it. Because you don't know how to Google things. So I'm the bad guy here because you don't know how to use Google. Insanity. Once again, peasants. That's what I'm calling everybody from now on. And if people get upset about it, they get upset about it. If people don't know about it and get mad at me for it, fuck it. Let's be honest, it, does, it doesn't really matter. It's words. And if words get you angry, well, I guess that's a thing. Because <laughs> these words got me kind of angry. I'm not going to lie, actually. So we're a little bit redundant in that statement, but whatever. <laughs> I love everybody that watches my content. I always enjoy, enjoy meeting everybody at Yu-Gi-Oh! events. Going to events, say, seeing people, taking pictures with you guys, doing autographs, which I don't know why you want those, but I do them anyway because I know you guys like that. And I just enjoy playing the game. I'm just a regular guy who just likes to make YouTube videos and enjoy playing the game Yu-Gi-Oh! That simple, that easy. And I'm gonna continue. If anyone that gets upset when I say the word peasant in the future, from now on, they're just peasants. <laughs> anyway, I really appreciate you guys watching my videos. Make sure to hit the subscribe button if you have to hit the subscribe button already. Hit the like button, comment down below. It's V, peasants. <laughs> and you peasants have a great day.